gives me a great deal of pleasure today to introduce the head coaches for Team Canada East and Team Canada West for the 2011 World Junior A Challenge. Uh, starting on the far end, I'm pleased to announce the head coach of Team Canada East will be Curtis Hodgins. Next to him is uh, Mr. Mark Ferner, head coach and GM of the Vernon Vipers, who I am pleased to announce will serve as the head coach for Team Canada West. All right, Mark, what is it that interests you in, in getting involved with the World Junior A Challenge? Well, I, I think it was a no-brainer, no question. Whenever you have an opportunity to um, work with Hockey Canada, you, 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 you try to. Certainly, um, you know, the people that are involved in, in the program are tremendous hockey people, and um, it's been very intriguing to me for quite a few years, and, and certainly this is a tremendous opportunity, tremendous honour and a, a privilege to be able to coach in a tournament like this. Obviously, you have quite a bit of experience in a short-term tournament, having been to the RBC Cup three years in a row. How does that experience going to help you in a short-term tournament like the World Junior A Challenge? Um, hopefully, it'll help a lot. I mean, with the people involved, uh, you know, we've got a great support staff, and um, you know, we'll, we'll certainly be leaning on on them a lot with this type of tournament. But um, you know, I just I just look forward to the opportunity. You know, with us being here at the RBC uh, ourselves as a hockey team, we have some unfinished fit business, but at the same time, you know, like I said, I can't overstate it enough that it's a tremendous honor and privilege to coach. Uh, for, for Hockey Canada in a tournament like this. We often ask players what it means to them to get to represent their country. As a coach, what does it mean to you to, to get to work and represent Team Canada? Oh, shoot. I mean, growing up as a hockey player and, and getting into coaching, you always look at that, that Canadian flag and, and always wondered what it would be like to uh, not only play but also coach. And, you know, again, thanking Hockey Canada for giving me that opportunity. And, um, you know, I'm very excited about it. Uh, I know my family is, and um, I mean, uh, again, it, it's humbling, but also to have this opportunity is great. All right, Curtis, what is it that interests you in getting involved in the World Junior Challenge for a second time? Well, I, I had such a great time last year. I mean, I was blown away. I didn't know going in last year to Penticton and what to expect in that event, but uh, just to see how well run that was, see the caliber play, and uh, we, we just had great chemistry last year as a, as a Canada East staff, and uh, it, was a, it was a tremendously enjoyable 14 days, and uh, as a coach, I'm always looking to get better, and this is a, a terrific vehicle to do that, and uh, I'm really looking forward to this year's version of World Junior A. How does last year's experience, how will last year's experience help you going into this year? Well, I got a feel for, for the caliber of play. That was one thing going in last year. I was trying to watch some, some videos, trying to catch up. And uh, um, now I got a feel for, for what it's about, the, the speed that you need, the, you know, and the, and the specialty teams, I think, are a big part of that tournament. Any short-term short -term tournament, your special teams are going to win or lose you that. So uh, I think now I got a, a bit of a vision of what kind of hockey players we need on Canada East to win gold, and uh, that will certainly help me moving forward here. We often ask players what it means to them to get to represent Team Canada. As a coach, what does it mean to you? Oh, it's a, it's a terrific thrill. Uh, just last year with 4,000 people in the building uh, cheering for you in Penticton, uh, uh, it was a huge thrill. And, uh, you know, everybody grows up watching Hockey Canada games, the World Junior Games and, and the Olympic Games, and uh, it, it's, uh, it's, it's definitely an honour to wear the, uh, the jersey and represent the country as head coach.